Hello everyone and welcome to another IA Roadkill Gaming video. We are playing Farming Simulator 19 and we are in Lone Oak. We are with Normal Economy 9 Days Seasons trying to achieve 10 million in bank. We are playing on the PlayStation 4 and this is episode 4. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button please. Thank you. We are... We're wondering why it's so dark. Six o'clock in the morning, we're supposed to be doing our work. We have a contract to do, so we best be getting to it. Another fertilizer job. Ground temperature is not quite ready for us to plant our own fields yet, so we have a little bit more preparation time. I don't even know where I'm going. Field 44. Forty-four. Where's forty-four? Oh, that's the big one on the side. Well, I'll get that started. Maybe it'll be a little bit brighter out. We'll talk to you in a bit. Yeah, it's a little bit brighter now. We're getting around. We did one loop all the way around and we're on our third pass on this side. I got a phone call from the dealership said that they had a used tractor coming in for 90,000 I believe he said. He said, it's not a little tractor, but it's about the same engine size as we have, but it can get scaled up to 250 horsepower. But it's $90,000. Do I want a second tractor for that? Not sure. At this point, I think I'd rather invest in some more land than equipment. I don't know. I've got a little while to think about it while I work this property. Speaking of working this property, I've been approached. I got th three more phone calls. A couple little fields and a medium-sized field to uh, cultivate. I'm sorry. fertilize everybody's getting their extra fertilization in since it's such a late spring yeah I think I'm gonna hold off on that tractor until we buy some more property I think that would be the wise move we already got a little bit of a loan. We don't want to have too much more. Well, I will keep working on this, and I will get back with you in a little bit. There we go. And Mason Newton just told me that this field 31, eight and a half acres, is for sale. So, oh, $250,000. Do we go in debt that far? 
This is the road to 10 million positive, not 10 million negative, but you can't make money if you don't have the real estate. What to do? What to do? Maybe I will tell him tomorrow. Yeah, I might pull the trigger tomorrow. Should be able to start planting. And that was actually one of the properties that we have already worked on. 31. It is already plowed and, whoa, plowed and just needs a little bit of lime on the outside edge. Other than that, it's a good field. Nice and flat. Yep. I think we're going to buy it. We will go into debt for real estate. We need some more fertilizer. This tractor is filthy. Whoops, wrong turn. Oh, never knew a bush to be that hard before. We're coming over here. And I think it's right here. Do you believe? So let's do an outside ring again. I do still want to buy some cows, probably mid-summer, late summer, early fall, somewhere in there. I was thinking about getting some grassland to start with so I could make up some hay, but I guess we will buy hay to feed them. I did find out that we do own the pig farm area. So we can raise pigs whenever we want to. Don't believe I'm ready to do that yet. We also own a sheep pasture, which I haven't gone to look at yet. Not sure what I think about sheep. Maybe we'll, I don't know, get a few sheep to start with. Let them breed and maybe grow the f flock. Is it a flock of sheep? A herd of sheep? A gaggle of sheep? I don't know. So I also talked to the banker, and he said that 
we have shown promise and we have enough equity in the land that we own now that he has no problem extending us credit to the point of we could get ourselves in trouble real, real easy. I think he's going to give me upwards of another fifty hundred, fifty five hundred thousand dollars credit. Well, yeah, that will have land against it. Possibly if I purchased all land with it, but without dedicated income, I don't think I want to swing that yet. He could get me into big trouble. I think we're going to buy field 31. And test the waters. See how we do. And then next spring, summer, we can decide... If we want to bite off more. The other two contracts we have are right in front of us. Um, no. Well, yeah. That field right there in front of us was field five. And I really should start spraying or spreading fertilizer instead of just talking. Let's try that again. There we go. Get over here. Yeah. So this little one right here is five. And then skip a field and the next one back there is seven. Those are the two fields we have to do still. So I'm going to skip ahead. I'll get those fields done. And we will see what time it is. See what we might, what we might have time to do else today. Besides learn to talk. We are done with the fertilizing contracts that we had. Me first, car. And I am going to spend a little more time doing some cultivating contracts. And I'm pulling in here because we don't have a cultivator yet. I'm going to pull over here and drop that off. And let's buy. Did a little research. This is the biggest cultivator that we can get for this tractor. The Rowl. I have used this before. Very nice unit. If you hire workers, they do not overlap excessively with it. Very nice. I like it. Oh my goodness. I have got to wash this. Oh. So, I have been doing a lot of cutscenes. And the reason for that is I need to get through as many contracts as I can early game because money is tight. I'm planning on making money even tighter, so I need to get as many contracts done as, as I can. So, I am headed towards... Field number 26. Oh. 
up here, turn left, past my property, on the right. And there is my property, our property. Oh, I haven't cultivated that yet. Maybe I should do my own cultivating first. That won't make me any money, but it will get me ready for possibly planting tomorrow. Uh, this is field 26 right here. Let's see. Check the map. Our property is already fertilized. Oh, I do need to put a little lime down on the outside edge. Shoot. Well, I think we need to hire a worker. And I need to look into buying that other tractor. That way I can be working on my fields while I am making money on contracts. And I didn't tell him I was going to do the job yet. Well, let's tell him we're going to do it. 26. Where's 26? There it is. Awesome. We'll put a couple headlands down here and then hire a worker. Oh, I'm worried we're going to get in trouble. Have too much debt for the first year. But, takes money to make money, right? I thought I picked you up. Oops, oops, oops. There. Now it's picked up. Get one of those high school kids over here. Get them started to work for me. That'll free me up so I can get some lime on our two fields here so that they're ready to go. And then we'll cultivate our fields in. So I'll be right back with you as soon as I just hire the worker so they can get this done. All right. So here is the other used tractor. As you can see, I now have zero dollars. And I have taken out a bigger loan. And I think I may have to take out another $5,000 because I should probably fill this up with fertilizer before I go home. We are now up to 340,000 for a loan. There we go. I'm not sure if we'll be able to get it all in this load, but better than Better than nothing. Or a little more than nothing. Oh, we got it all. Nice. Well, we are now a two-tractor farm. This one is... hundred and fifty five horse which is actually just a little bit smaller than our first tractor 
but this one has the potential to go up to 261 horse so that will come in handy in the future am I slowing up traffic I sure am sorry buddy I got the pedal to the floor you're uh, burning excess fuel there, pumping your gas pedal, in case you weren't aware of that. I did not buy a weight for the front of this tractor, which might have been a mistake, but we'll get one later when we get something heavier. This tractor still has that new tractor smell. Look at how clean those floor pads are. It won't be that way for long. Now with my big muddy feet. Okay, so I need to go unload the fertilizer and get some lime. And then come back and spritz the edges of our field. And it just so happens that we have a bulk lime unit right here at our farm. And we can fill it up. Close the lid. $575. That's not too bad for some lime. I don't know that we'll have to buy any more. That should be enough. I just kind of dumped the fertilizer right there in the middle of the drive. Another payment out to our high school student. They're making lots of good money today. Now, there's a little gate entrance here. Let's check the map. Where do we need to put lime? Over here. You know what? I think I'm just going to lime the whole field. That way the entire field will come due at the same time. One field done. Actually, I should have done this bottom edge from the other side because I'm going to want to come back over here. Oops, missing just a little bit there. I'm going to have to get a chainsaw too. I need to get rid of these little trees. so I can plow that out later. Okay, let's go up this direction. And I'm out of lime. I knew that was going to happen. Don't know why I was... So surprised, I'm going to run back and get some lime and I'll be back in just a second. Well, there's our worker. Working hard, getting the field done for us so we can do other things. Okay, I'll be back in a second. I already have it open. Come on, there we go. 
Fill me up. Another five hundred dollars. Close the lid. We really need to own this grassland since it's right next to our our big machine shed. Someday I might have scratched the paint there just a little bit. Oop, we missed just a tad. And we're going to be out. There we go. We may have to go see the banker again at this rate. I didn't know this much lime was going to be needed to do these two fields. Oh well. We'll sneak back out right here. There's our student again. Hard at work. I know it's just my fun let's play, but I really don't like to do that. What, you might ask? Cut through other people's fields. I really don't like that. I do it from time to time, but I don't really like it. All right, we gotta split the eye of the needle here. Yeah, we did it again. Okay, open the lid. And get up there. Fill it up. How much is this going to cost? 575. Well, we won't be able to fill it again, will we? I do not consider that driving through the other person's field. We were just driving around our building. They're going to be done here pretty quick. We are going to have to go back and buy one more thing of lime. Hopefully it'll be enough to finish, though. I think it will. We're down to $370, but that might be enough lime to finish this field. And we're off. One more little bit of lime, and I'll be right back.
And I believe there are two spots up here. This. And did I miss? Yes, right along the edge up here. That wasn't one of them. Just checking it. But right here. And how about right here? No, but it looks like it right there. Okay, and we have just a little bit left. Not too much overspent. We will go drop off the lime, grab the fertilizer, and I don't know if we can hit this with fertilizer now or not, but we'll give it a try. Our worker is almost done with this edge. What are they doing? Oh, they're probably going back to work on the rest of that over there. All right, let's see if I can... I can fertilize this again. That is almost strange. But who am I to judge? Maybe we gave it the fertilizing state by plowing in old crops. I don't know if we did that or not. Awfully rough driving over these ruts. Holy cow. Now I have to drive right past that post and not hit it. Like that. That looks good. Okay, now we will come over here, turn around these silly little bushes. Put a headland in here. So yeah, these two fields are going to have double fertilization except for the outside little edge we better check on the other worker or on the worker well they're doing good so are we with my drive a straight line helper which you will catch me using quite frequently I didn't want to scratch the paint anymore, so I went that way this time. I think that's good enough, but 
I don't want to risk it. I'm going to come down here and start a full width. And when we get back over there, we'll see what we need to do to finish. How about right there? That looks pretty good. Almost at our maximum. Just so I can get this other little piece in one pass coming back is my hope. Which, one, two, three, four columns looks like I'll be able to just do. One o'clock. Oh, and I missed that one little spot again. I did that the last time on the lime. And now we come down and get this one little spot. Whoops, didn't mean to spray that long. Well, let's see. Sure wish I had another cultivator. I could cultivate my own property now. Well... Yeah, I have lost my mind. Our debt is now up to 370000 I had them upgrade the tractor. And I bought a bigger cultivator. We've got all these cultivating jobs to do. I might as well have the big tractor do it. And it is now the big tractor because it has 188 horsepower, I believe. Yes, 188. Spent $15,000 to upgrade the engine. And then another 10000 on the cultivator. So we spent 90 on the tractor. A hundred and fifteen thousand now. Oh, we're in debt up to our eyebrows. I'd like to thank everyone who stayed to watch the entire video. If you found it enjoyable, I would appreciate it if you would hit that like button. If you'd like to see more, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. And if you would like to leave a comment, you may do so below. With that said, I'd like to wish everyone, including you, a very wonderful day. Goodbye for now.